The 1980s Franciscan priest murders refers to the mysterious disappearances and or murders of two Catholic priests in the western United States between 1982 and 1984. On August 5, 1982, Father Reynaldo Rivera, a priest at the Cathedral Basilica of St. Francis in Santa Fe, New Mexico, was murdered in an unknown location and his body found three days later. A year and a half later, on July 20, 1984, Father John Kerrigan of the Sacred Heart Catholic Church in Ronan, Montana, disappeared after leaving a bakery. Several days later, bloody darticles of clothing were found along Montana Highway 35, as well as a blood-stained coat hanger. Kerrigan's vehicle was discovered in Polson seven days later, his wallet, which contained $1,200, was left in the trunk of the car, along with a bloody shovel and pillowcase. Kerrigan's remains have never been recovered. Rivera's autopsy showed that he had been strangled with some form of metal cord, possibly a coat hanger, while in Kerrigan's disappearance, a tangled and bloody coat hanger was found along with his clothing. Both men were approximately 58 years old at the time of their respective deaths and disappearances. Law enforcement attempted to uncover further connections between Kerrigan and Rivera, and found that Kerrigan had spent time at the Congregation of the Servants of the Paracletine Hemis Springs, New Mexico, in 1983 prior to his appointment in the Roman Catholic Diocese of Helena. This congregation was used as a retreat for clergy suffering from personal difficulties, such as substance abuse, depression, and sexual misconduct. Though the Diocese of Helena admitted Kerrigan had spent nearly a year there, they did not disclose the reason. No evidence was uncovered that Kerrigan and Rivera ever knew one another personally.